This was a very big week for us, but beyond the reasons I mentioned at the top of the show. Oh, yeah. It was a very big week because we, I mean, every other day had something popping off here at Mega64 HQ here in San Diego. We actually released our first game ever. Ever. Now, here's what was, here's what worked out great about the release of this Go ahead. is. You know, I uh, th there's something about April Fool's Day. I mean, April Fool's Day can annoy the hell out of anybody. Yes. True. And 100%. we've got a record saying that we don't generally yes. like Not it that fans. much. Internet's insufferable. That day. And we started to, we, so we, this is long running Mega 64 lore. Mm -hmm. We did a video, our Doug Huggum sketch in 2011. We did it at the end of the video. We made a, a joke that, we're, oh yeah, we're, we're going to make this game. It's all about politeness and good manners and uh, all of that stuff. And it's coming out in March. 2024 and again we said that in 2011 because it was funny to mm. say like oh you think it's gonna be this march uh it's in you 13 years it randomly <laughs> yeah it was definitely random, random month yeah like derek what? just said a, a year a month yep. totally. yeah totally what sounds so far out in the future in that, insane was comical. that the world will definitely be destroyed by then <laughs> yeah, yeah. we'll all be dead <laughs> yeah no but one uh nope we made it and it would we started to hear Huh, I wonder if they're actually going to release Doug Huggum. And, and we started to sweat. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, we got to get started. Made a promise. <laughs> people know about that? People remember so, that video? But here's the thing. So we started to hype up. Hey, uh, March 2024, like we promised, it's coming out. March 31st, you know, like give us the until the last second mm -hmm. and it will come out. Our plan all along was to then we're going to announce hey, it's delayed till April 1st. And one then day. everyone will go, oh, they're going to pull a fast one. They're going to announce it's delayed again until like 2090 or something, you know, whatever. What's funny is I was starting to get tweets from people that were actually angry. I mean, I get those every day anyway, but <laughs> I, I was getting some that were like, I'm, I think it's so pathetic. You guys used to make fun of April Fool's and now you're giving into it just to stay relevant, you know, stuff, just mean people tweets. But what was cracking me up behind all that is like, we, the whole thing we hated about April Fools is that these brands come out, hey, we're gonna put out the shoes from Back to the Future. And then the day comes, ah, no, no, we're not. Yeah, uh, like, I, I really want oh, those. I, was, I like yeah, those shoes. That's, that's oh, we're gonna, we're gonna um, release, uh, we're gonna have free Crystal Pepsi for everyone <laughs> on earth. Just kidding. Oh, that would have been great. That would have been awesome. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm making those up, but you know what I mean? Like yeah. stuff that you would actually look forward to and they just don't do it. Yeah. Well, we've done two, we've actually done two April Fool's jokes now. Mm -hmm. Last year's, we hyped up the thing you've been asking for is coming April 1st. And it ended up being the thing, a lot of things, uh, you know, something that a lot of people had been asking for, yeah. which was the unboxing ring Blu-ray. Yeah. So it was an April Fool's joke, like yeah. what, you're really making that? But at the same time, people did want it. Yeah. And yeah. we actually made it. Yep. Yep. So we went by the same logic this year and we actually made Doug hug him. The, we didn't dick everyone around. We actually put a game mm -hmm. yeah. on our website. But Okay, go ahead. Well, the part that was a joke was that we said this would be our Elden Ring. <laughs> well, I think it is. That, that part was. Yeah, I mean, some people have compared well, it to. It's our first game, so it's like every game. It's, it's yeah. you know, it's that's also like a Mario Kart if you think about uh, it, because yeah, people yeah. only don't want a game. Yeah. <laughs> I think uh, you know, I I saw all the anger and I was like, I love that they're so mad because they oh, think yeah. that we're fucking with them. Yeah. But they're gonna get an actual game. But they're game. gonna get a game. Now, whether they think it's the best game ever made, that's a, that's their call. Yeah, I think it remains yeah, yeah. to be seen. I, I think it I is. had a lot of fun. <laughs> and there's it, it currently was, it was like, fun to play. There's currently like huge gamers streaming this online as we speak. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, other people are right, playing it. Literally right now. Right now. Is it Scor Scorby? Scopens, right? Scopens. Sockpens. Sockpens. Scorpy. <laughs> Scorpion. <laughs> Get over Brad here. Brad Neely's Hargnollin <laughs> Sclopio <laughs> Peepio. <laughs> but don't they go, aren't they, don't they oh go by God. Scorpio or am I thinking of somebody else? Yeah, they yeah, do. Okay, okay. So I was, I, yeah. I was right. Scrunt, that's what it was. I get my yeah. Senior Pelo and my Scorpio, you know, confused. <laughs> senior Pelo, I'm sure they're streaming it too. I'm sure, no, but all these, dude, uh, yeah. streaming it. Vinny was yeah. uh, Vinny uh, playing it the other day. Yeah, uh, yeah. All these, all these uh, uh, luminaries in the industry uh, dentists, even I'm just even, even Dennis. Uh, <laughs> no, but everybody has been streaming it, playing it. It absolutely warms my heart. Yeah. Um, 
and blows me away that people are doing that. It re I really was more excited for this April Fool's Day than ever. I mean, I was just like mm. so excited that it's like oh, no one thinks they're actually getting a game, but you are. I mean, yeah. sort of, but you are. You no, it's a, uh, hey, it's a game it's a you game can play. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That is a real thing. So uh, anyway, I want to give a huge shout out to Brandon and the team at Get Bonus. Yes. Could yeah. it give a bigger shout out Be to these people? And you may, if if you don't know the name, you will. We got here on, oh, a, yeah. on a past stream. We were looking for weird games to play and we found Citizen Kane 64. Uh, they also made, didn't they make Kingdom Hanks? That yeah, was them so too. We, oh my God. We're big two. fans. That's too classic. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Their games, games were so funny. Then we met them, what, on tour? Mm -hmm. Is that what it was? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Met them on tour and they couldn't have been cooler. And uh, and they were talking with me about like, yeah, you know, want to get more, you know, um, they're adding more stuff to Citizen Kane 64, like a new update for that. They're doing all kinds of new stuff. Let's stay in touch. Ever want to do something? And then, yeah, the Doug Huggum thing started to come around and it was like, wait, that this month is when we said it would be Perfect. out. Uh oh. <laughs> but what a what a like universe giving us exactly what yeah. we're yeah. looking for, man. So with we I mean, we seriously, I mean, we we kept saying this is on a you know a 13 year production cycle. <laughs> when the truth is they had a few weeks, maybe. I mean, I would yeah, that, that a few is I would say they had yeah. maybe two and a half weeks. Like uh <laughs> when it was all you, said and done. Possible yeah. to it was, do anything. It was Brandon, I'm sorry. That Brandon you and uh, their team is get bonus. Get yeah. Bonus. So yeah. I think uh, what I heard is when you were kind of running this by the team, I think Brandon had mentioned, well, I made Citizen Kane 64 in a, a game jam, which is like a 48 hour. I don't know if Citizen Kane was part of that, Maybe but they had done other stuff. They Because they, 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 you were kind of prefacing like, yeah. hey, the turnaround on this might be like Pretty absolutely quick. ridiculous. Yeah. And I, I think their reply was like, well, we've done these game jams. We farted something out in yeah. 48 hours. So we'll see. Yeah. And uh, I think they spent a lot more time on it than that. Yeah. Because there is a lot of game there. Surprisingly, like I went through it's like incredible. four or five times. Yeah. There's a ton of Mega Six Four references in yeah, there. And yeah. That's the thing yeah. is, Grink is hidden in there. I'm going to be in there. Like, <laughs> let me be all completely honest. We didn't write no. anything. <laughs> really? <laughs> no. We uh, uh, What I supplied was the... Um, you know, there's certain like description descriptions of it. I, I don't know if any of my text is actually in the game. I don't mm -hmm. think so. And I gave uh, Brandon the um, the I actually gave him the old recordings from when um, John St. John did. Uh, yeah, the mm -hmm. original recordings we did in 2011, which mm -hmm. can I say that is I think what is legitimizing this game. Having <laughs> having John St. John is having it John St. John it is. Yeah. Yeah. parody his most famous character yes. in yeah. this and it being real. It's yeah. really him. It's really lines from yeah. him. And uh, double checked with him too before, oh, yeah. John, before we did it. Because that and, was filmed with no intention to yeah. make a game no, out of it. In 2011, yeah. Yeah, and so I, I, sent, I sent John St. John an email just to make sure it was cool with you and I could, it was just a quick, we just had a quick exchange mm -hmm. over the old iPhone and I, but I could feel the, the energy of, uh, wait, you're really doing this? Like, <laughs> like, like the email was like, yeah, that's cool with me. Oh my gosh. What? You know, but, uh, so that, that was out. really cool. And he's always been extremely cool. Yeah. With us every very time cool. Done something with him. So anyway, uh, but yeah, but although he didn't do any new recordings, those are the original recordings we made in 2011. And he used that. But other than that, Brandon pretty much put all this together himself, wrote it all, or or, or his team, you know, yeah. uh, his team too. Named uh, all the characters. He had some friend, uh, friends that get bonus. Yeah, they, they, together. they named everyone. Like, I like, there was like Rebecca PayPal or something they, like that. I don't they, know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They usually, they, they, they like perfectly adapted and followed like the Mega 64 naming scheme mm -hmm, like yeah. on their own. It was great. So, um, yeah. So, anyway, all of that, we were just, you know, after like a week and a half or two weeks, it was just like, yeah, just checking in. How's that going for you? And then he sent me screenshots. I was like, you're, you're kidding me. This is unreal. It's this like is so, so much good. better than I thought it could ever yeah. be. Yeah. And then we saw like a quick little thing with like dialogue. and like, oh, we could do voices for that. And so we just, without even asking, recorded voices. Yeah. Like, I, just in case you want to put this in there. Like, I don't know if you have time. Yeah, we but, just sent that over. But here yeah. you go. And then, yeah, they slapped them all in. And oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> so it, it was all just, uh, and I didn't even know on my end, I'm like, I don't even know, can, can this be embedded in our website? I don't know how to do that. Like, so I, I just learned myself how to 
put that into our website. Really? I, this really? Is, I believe it or not, I didn't ask for help from anybody. I don't, I don't know that, shit don't? about that, but I'm just like, no, I'm going to figure this out. I'm going to stay late, figure this out. Okay, let's plug this in. So we found a way to do that, but then uh, uh, Brandon also has a, an EXE, a, you know, uh, a link that yeah, you yeah, can yeah. download it to your PC. And play That's it how everyone's whatever. getting it on their Steam Deck. Yeah, I saw yeah, tons yeah, of people yeah, playing exactly. on their Steam Deck. That's exactly. really so, cool. So, And that all came together extremely last minute. It was seriously like the night before Easter, just like, yep. okay, I'm going to try to embed it on the site. Oh, it worked. Okay. Um, yeah, well, I got the executable. Okay. Well, I think we're ready to go. Okay. It couldn't have been more last minute. And mm. All of it. All of it. <laughs> Isn't that crazy how, like, we've been in this industry for so long. We've heard about the nightmares of launching a game. Yeah. Didn't really Easy. have that effect. Yeah, what are these developers if complaining you about? Work with Git Bonus. It's no problem. <laughs> yeah, they're yeah. With work them. Work with them. Don't work with the. You know. I don't know what the problem is. Uh, oh, the new Last of Us. We were under crunch for two years. Yeah. Uh, whatever. Brandon from Get Bonus. Yeah. Is Get out of here, naughty dog. There. We need a day one patch. No, we don't. Ready He's, to go. We don't know. Neil Druckmann's wasting your time. You got to get bonus. Also, <laughs> crunch culture that everyone's complaining about. Yeah, I was up late the Saturday before Easter. Then I slept in and ate deviled eggs. Perfect. Now, I don't know what the Get Bonus is a deal. Maybe they were crunching. I don't know. <laughs> I, 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 I assume. I know. That. I know. Watch, we're going to email from him like, guys, I fucking didn't sleep. We didn't, we didn't sleep, sleep for two we weeks. Sleep. Um, uh, but anyway, they couldn't have been more awesome. Yeah. So I do just want to say just real quick, mm -hmm. uh, I really do want you to check out more of the get bonus stuff, uh, stuff like, like citizen Kane 64 and the other games they made, uh, get bonus dot itch dot IO. Please go there. Yeah. Check out the rest of their stuff, support them, you know, go nuts. If you're a big game publisher out there, use them for your next big game. Yes. Yeah, Higher honestly, down. no shit. Like, do they are so hundred percent great? And our games less. They he spent that <laughs> amount of time on it, like we just said. Yeah, and it's less glitchy than Cyberpunk was when it launched.